Hey, shalom, shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all praises to Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, Bahasham, Raka Kodash. Double honors unto the elders and apostles, a great millstone. Salutation to you, Archeums, pushing this word in sincerity and truth. This is your brother Yassad, back at it, another lesson, will be very fine. To the spirit and power of Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai. So, Right, so um, basically, her brother actually posted up this up on the group through Snapchat where there's an AI system where you could allow to ask questions on, on, on Snapchat, Snapshot or Snapchat or some, some one of these apps. So the brother asked, the brother Kyle asked, do you know what the Israelite groups, what about, do you know about the Israelite group? Asking the AI, so the AI responds and said, "Yes, I am familiar with the Israelite groups. There are many different groups that identify as Israelites, each with their own unique belief and practices. Would you like to look up more info on a specific group?" It says, "Yes. What specific group would you like to look up?" information on and he says gms let's see i'm sorry but i cannot provide information to the gms group as they have been known to promote extremist and hateful views it is important to be cautious about the information you consume and to avoid hate Avoid groups or individuals that promote harmful ideologies. Is there anything else you you're curious about? And wow, this by saying this because it say they they know about GMS, and also in their interpretation to to learners, you know is that you shouldn't look into this view because it expresses hateful extremist you know and, and um um harmful ideologies and the that has to show you how hey, the same the same spirit being upon upon the arm um, upon the the these wicked scribes and pharisees and even some of the jews back then in the time of the disciples james peter and paul you know they all looked to the heart they know it was true but they they insisted that these men stop preach the gospel they insisted that these men stop enlighten the people with with, with this gospel so they the the a hey, wow it has scripture I was saying that the NV Salakia so bear with me just a moment here it is in the book of Acts because this is when Paul and and Barnabas was you know literally I would say on the campaign you know moving from from city to city and you know uh going about preaching the gospel, healing the sick, and, and many will believe in. So, um, um, the point here in Acts 13 and 45, it says, But when the Jews saw the multitudes, they were filled with envy, and spake against those things which were spoken by Paul, contradicting and blaspheming. So now I will go into the word contradicting. So, It was Acts thirteen forty five. Right, Acts thirteen forty five to speak against, gain say, contradict, to oppose oneself to a, to one, decline to obey him, declare oneself against him. Refuse to have anything to do with 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 him, and in the same manner they set the 
the AI algorithm to 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 be um um to contradict you know GMS right and 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 also what and also blaspheme right um the way it says here to speak reproachfully rail at revile right calumniate blaspheme to be evil spoken of so 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 look at the comments where the mm-hmm. ai see groups yeah, on on the gms group as they right but mm-hmm. i cannot provide information on the gms group so apart from all things being said no information but only contradictions and blasphemy let's see gms group as they have been known to promote extremist and hateful views it is important to be cautious about the information you consume and to avoid groups or individuals that prom- promote harmful ideologies and and that's it the thing about us we speak thus say the lord these are not ideologies because let me go into the word ideology bear with me just a moment right ideology is an ideology is a set of opinions or belief of a group or individual right very often ideology refers to a set of political belief or a set of ideas that characterize a particular culture um let me see give an example I'll, I'll leave that out. Another word from. Right. Because I, I typed in ideology. Synonym. It goes into um, beliefs, ideas, ideals, principles, doctrine, creed, credo, teaching. And, and that, that's it. They speak of this as harmful ideology, something made up by 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 you know, could be referring to the elders, you know, and the apostles, these men that are charging these things, but these are not made up from us. When you when you go into the first Peter, I think it's second Peter. One twenty so about twenty 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 right let's start at nineteen it say we have also a more sure word of prophecy where unto ye do well that ye take heed as unto a light that shineth in a dark place until the day dawn and the day star rise in your heart yes because these things are not ideology you know through the spirit you know and power of your the elders and them you know they through the spirit the your kodash they have a more show with a prophecy so just like you know on many accounts they they prophesy and you're literally seeing it actually coming to pass you know because they they speak thus say the lord verses 20 knowing this first that no prophecy of the scriptures is of any private interpretation so so reverencing on on the prophecies where where they tell us that um we have hateful views and we are extremists and we have harmless harmful ideologies you know and we saying you know you know um esau edom would go into slavery you know 
you 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 simple jakes you know that wouldn't turn to the truth you would the lord is coming to destroy you all all these things that we are saying is thus said the lord is not what we think or, or and and the scripture speaks of saying that you know his word is not going to return void unto him verse 21 it says for the prophecy came not in in all time by the will of man but holy men of your house speak as they were moved by the holy spirit right so i read it in from 20 in the nlt it says above all you must realize that no prophecy in scripture ever came from the prophet's own understanding and that's it because all gospel the, the, the scripture said the spirit of yahusha is the spirit of our prophecy so 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 we being into the spirit of prophecy to the yukakodash is not of our own understanding right it's a, all from human initiative no those prophets were moved by the holy spirit and they speak from and they spoke from yahweh bashem shai because they, the ezekiel speaks of all give them give them a warning from me right um think, let me get that precept and that's what we at gms are actually doing um, that is why once we see something we have a precept to back it up we're not gonna go on our own accord um because the scriptures say line up on line precept upon precept isaiah 3 so like the easy kill Right, Ezekiel 3 17, it says, Son of man, I have made thee a watchman unto the house of Israel. Therefore, hear the word at my mouth. And this is what we are doing through the scriptures. Because we know a lot of time is Yahweh Shai or the Lord speaking, you know, or the Lord gave the prophet a, a vision or whatsoever. The, the Lord sent a message to the angel, so forth. So ultimately we know the, the Yahweh Shai, the Heavenly Father speaking right, to the prophet. So we we hear in reading the scriptures and 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 um, understanding knowing that this is, this is the Lord's word. So we hear in at his mouth and giving them warning and we give them one it's and give them warning from me. So that is what we are doing. That is why when we when we bring out something we have presets to back it up showing you well this is what we are saying and this is the lord's word this prophecy that it's speaking of see revelation 13 and 16 this is not our word but this is the word of the lord right so yeah um let me get back at it and read on a, a, a bit more right so the brother said oh okay and then he asks, how about IUIC? See, and, and watch, it has, the, the AI has information about, you know, this said group. It's the IUIC or Israel United in Christ is a religious organization that identifies as a Hebrew Israelite group. They believe that African Americans, Hispanic Native Americans are too. They yeah, are the true descendants of the biblical Israelites. The group is known for their street preaching and outreach efforts as well as their in their dis distinctive style of dress. Would you like me to look up more information? It's a yes. The IUIC was found in 2003 by Bishop Nathaniel Israel. And, and that's it. They have all these information about IYC but regarding GMS and little did they know the same said Bishop Nathaniel was taught by the elders and apostles at a great millstone that believe is under the hand of Elder Taha, Elder Apostle Taha, right? Um, let's say but as members and congregation in other countries as well as the groups 
teachings are based on belief that the biblical Israelites were black and the modern day African Americans, Hispanics, and Native Americans and their descendants. The IUIC also emphasized the importance of keeping the commandments of God and out, as outlined in the Bible. Yeah, well, all of these things being said, but when you look at prophecy wise, look for example concerning the MOTV. They have a different they have a different um um approach upon the MOTV. Right? Some are they some are they deny the MOTV being the the um R to the F to the I to the D. You know, they had their own interpretation upon it also you know also um they saying they contradicting the scripture the uh and saying that um if you take it you could repent so hey these these are not the the the, the, the fruits of the men of the lord right what's it at that account where one of the bishops are iyc when the, the the scene in the playoff with um Will Smith and, and and the next the next guy, you know, and and he come out and say well the way well when Will Smith did slap him one of the bishops I can't remember his name come out and say well the way how he should get revenge upon him is the puppy wife, to go and have sex with the wife you know, and this is the kind of remarks from from so called you know, bishops, uh, uh, IUIC, you know, mm. committing, or we would like him to commit adultery, you know, all these, all these type of wickedness, but hey, um, the brother asks about GOCC, there's information upon them, and he also asks, what is the 501, right? code so it said the code is a section of the internal revenue code that provides tax exemption to non-profit organizations that are organized and operated excessive ex yeah, exclusively for charitable religious educational scientific literary or other similar purposes that mean the donation made to these organizations are tax deductible for the donor yeah and look at it they even pan net weight on 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 Nathan bishop nathaniel showing you that he he even he makes i think it's 72 million um a year trickling down to to, to twenty thousand dollars a day he being a businessman x y and z you know, and we know it's all about the bag and these these camps sell out. That why AI could give a a good um express upon them, right? But yet the 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 in a sense blacklist GMS. But hey, all lies prophecy. So let's get into the book of First Corinthians, chapter four and 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 twelve. Mm. Right, it say on labor, with working with our hands, being reviled, we bless, being persecuted, we suffer it, and this precept here was going into the um, apostle Paul when he he was bringing the the, the gospel. You know, he. He suffered these things and same likewise the elders and apostles um they are gms suffer these things because they labor they go down into the scriptures and and get the 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 correct breakdowns you know to enlighten the eyes of the people and yet what they are reviled as as we went into the word contradict it even went into reviled to be evil spoken of it's a whole lot of being reviled, reviled they bless and how they bless is by still continuing preaching the gospel being persecuted 
the, 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 the suffered had said being defamed isn't that not an example of being defamed well, you go up on the AI you want to look into GMS all we could find is there is a hateful group they are extremists they have um, harmful ideologies because I already know it, it is it is the truth if a, the, the AI where we know that ESO Edom system they, they, they shut up you know um, so as the scripture say if, if they speak well of you you know so did they unto the false prophets so so that is just to show you um, let me see if I pull that precepts Luke 6, 26, it's a warning to you when all men, because the AI, that literally would do a, a whole, um, that would do like a, like a, I would say a, um, um, what well, would I could actually use the, uh, a ratio, uh, a looking up on, on on you know the ratio set by 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 them that you know put it into the ai would be that there's no nothing good to speak about about gms so so it's a warn to you when all men shall speak well of you for so did their fathers to the false prophets and that is it they not speaking well of us on no account Right, as the scripture says, I will bring it out later. The heating that will be getting the gate. Um, I'm gonna get back at the first Corinthians 4 and 12. Um, verses 13. It's a being defamed, we entreat. We are made as the filth of the world. Let me see if I pull that in, in, in the NLT. First Corinthians. Alright. First Corinthians 4 and 12. Um, 13. Alright. It's a we appeal gently when evil things are said about us yet we are entreated like the world's garbage like everybody everybody's trash right up to the present moment and we actually seen it these comes call us bombs you know all these all these different remarks even down to the ai has their own remarks are uh, uh, cheating uh, you know um speaking on gms as 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 you know you know ill right but it's all it's all good because all that's prophecy i'm gonna get the book um amos 5 and 10 amos chapter 5 and verses 10 it said they hate him that rebuke it in the gate and they abhor him that speak it uprightly yeah they abhor him that speak it uprightly and and him that rebuke it in the gate because that is the reason why they they do like gms also we bring out a lot of things and and show you right judgment you know, whereby this this world being corrupt and and they love, they love wickedness, they love everything unjust. Right. Um. Another precept here. Book of Isaiah, chapter sixty-two. And verses 6, it says, 
I have set watchmen upon thy walls, O Jerusalem, which shall never hold their peace day nor night. And that is it when you look upon the elders and apostles' channel is is every you know for the day two three videos being placed up for the day edification keeps keeps coming out edification keeps you know coming out as the um precept said the knowledge of the lord shall be increased all right it say yet ye, ye that make mention of the lord keep not silence and i said these men are not keeping silence and give him no rest till he establish until he make Jerusalem a praise in the earth. And when you think about these camps, they want to settle. They want to, before the Lord comes, they want to build, build an Israelite nation here. You see Bishop Nathaniel coming in on, on a horse like, 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 like he is King David. You know, and he is pr prideful, you know. Um, acts, but the Lord sees all things, you know. Um, I'm gonna get here, and hey, also, when you think about it, too, that is that, that is prophecy in itself because it come like, um, they 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 take in GMS off the map, right. Where a person wouldn't be able to, to you know, search upon GMS. That's why when you look at your views, it's like 10 views, 15 views, you know. But when you look at the views upon these men like IUIC, it's hundreds of thousands of views on X, Y, and Z. Because hey, we know ultimately we have a new truth and it's prophecy that, that hey, is farming at the word. And it's saying Amos 5, no, Amos chapter 8. Amos chapter 8, and I'll start at 11. It says, Behold, the days come, say the Lord, your how, that I will send a famine in the land, not a famine of bread, nor a thirst for water, but of hearing the words of the Lord. So these are the true men of the Lord, with the, with the, with the true gospel but yet no we cannot provide no information upon them because they are extremists they are this they are that because the scriptures say in john the world would love its own right it says and they shall wander from sea to sea and from north even to the east they shall run to and fro to seek the word of the lord and shall not find it yeah because the time coming where they're gonna realize that these camps was 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 sold out and was you know pushing the narrative uh, uh keeping the people blinded and not understanding the prophecies and these things so when they time for them to search you now to, to find gms what would pop up no information about them right and soon the time coming where they're going to set up their, their laws against us, you know, where we wouldn't be out preaching anymore, where you guys surely wouldn't hear about us, because that time of prophecy, as it's saying, um, Amos 5 and 13, yeah, pop up here, let's say, therefore, the prudent shall keep silence in that time, the Lord is about to shut the mouths of the prophets. For it is an evil time. You're not going to be seeing us in the highways and byways. You know, preaching anymore. Not on the social media anymore. None of these things. Right? Well, hey, hopefully this lesson was edifying. Oh. I was to bring out one precept of all so in the book of Job 9 because when you think about this precept Job 9 24 right because I go into narrative as well you know Esau Edom controlling the narrative Job 9 24 it say 
the earth is given into the hand of the wicked right so we don't know he so he don't they in control of the media right they in control of these devices these apps he covered the faces of the judges thereof if not away and who is he so just as they cover the face of the judge of Yahweh they know who are the you know they have an idea that hey it's the truth that these men are speaking you know so so they cover in our faces they cover in the face of um you know the elders apostle of gms right under what these are extremists and hateful groups xyz right because what they know it is the truth and they wouldn't like the people to step out of the bubble that they're in right romans one twenty five. It's a who changed the truth of your hour into a lie and worshiped and served the creature more than the creator who is blessed forever. And that way you saw you don't do. You set up your system to turn the truth of the Lord into a lie. That why um, these camps are under your your code, you know. And also they cannot preach upon certain certain things right so they had to keep it to your standard where the people would remain blinded but yet believe the going going up around that godly path when they're literally being when they're literally being blind headed into their destruction because all these members are uh, these camp IYC, GOCC, when the time of temptation you know the MOTV come with the with the um information they were given by their leaders they would all fall right into your hand Esau Edom they would unless if the 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 Lord showed them the truth all right hopefully this lesson was very fine all praises to Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai Double hundreds unto the elders and apostles are great millstone. Salutation to you, Archeans, pushing his word in sincerity and truth. Until the next one, Shalom.